Hey guys, it's Sasuke here, and welcome back to Death Road to Canada. So, shall we continue? Casper and one other. The horror continues. Yikes! Oh yeah, we are driving the, uh, the ammo bill. The place sets up camp at the safest place they could find around a park. An abandoned mini golf park. Classic. Group eats a decent meal, so we lose four food. We get a little bit of morale. I mean, not much, but in the morning they're gonna go fall and putter while searching for the area. The group decides to play a quick game. We get some exercise. Hell yeah. Though the morale goes down, and, uh, you know. That's what it is, I guess. It's nice to have the whole road to ourselves. We do stuff in the middle of the road, stairs the car. We could use some food. Uh, okay. Bagging the deer while also going against any <laughs> Paris ethics. Okay, he's not bad at shooting. We got 10 food. I, I do feel a little bit bad. Hey, the preppers wanted something after all. The meat is making progress on the death road. Uh, yeah. We'll, we'll check it out. So this guy sells some ass, aka some gas. What do you sell? The group takes a meek looking woman. She invites you to check out her question rifles. I also found so many I'm looking to sell some. 15. And nah, I'm good. How about you? What, what is this contraption you have? Sweat helms, long warmers, and garnish exercise. Group training for nine? Hmm. I, I might consider it. If we could get the double fitness things going on, yeah. It might be good. Can we loot something? Oh my god, there's some gas in here. Oh my god, 23 gas for free. Now, I don't want to have to beat your asses, but I will. All oh, this loot in here, too. It's just a grenade on the ground. <laughs> I'm not gonna take that. I know what happens when I have grenades. I do wanna do this, though. We're gonna give nine for group training. So we see their fitness is terrible, but you know, our fitness is on the ups, man. We just got one for some uh, rad exercise, and now we got even more. I think it's a good thing. The, the more we can bash zombies in the face. We do have a lot of bullets, though. Capture tries to help, but it lacks enough medical supplies. Yeah, we do need one more. Tries to evade a large whore, blocked by the debris. They get stuck in a Yalmart parking lot. They're gonna have to fight here for a while. No escape, massive noon. Oh, great. I'm so happy that we have... Casper claims he was once a celebrity. Always so spouting pop culture quotes. Okay. Just get in. Would I would I rather be in or out? That's the true question. I think I'd rather be in. I think we're just gonna do the uh, the run around here as efficiently as possible. Anyway. Ugh. Okay, so I see something over here. We're playing it cool, baby. We're playing it cool. Don't attack so much. Quit. Oh god. Uh, good night, sweet prince. Wait, I got something in my eye. Damn. Hey, they're gonna they're gonna attack him. I say. Feels bad, man. When your uh, friend dies and they eat his corpse in front of you. Feels bad. I wanted that, but it was dangerous. Siege is over. Time to leave. Sorry you had to go down, my friend, but, um... Wait, where's the vehicle? Do we just leave? Yeah, let's hit the road. Well, uh... <laughs> we, um, we may have lost somebody, you know. I don't need who was that again? I don't even remember. That's how you have to think about it, as brutal as it is. Jeremiah feels inspired to magic to survive the situation. He feels like he is getting the hand of the hang of this. <laughs> Choose a reward for the survivor. Uh we probably need some morale, honestly. So he's slightly less terribly pissed off and the shooting's better. You know. Alrighty. We still need HP. Then finally Chase Soldiers was able to cobble together a campsite. The weather is terrible all night. Ah. <sighs> 
Just what we needed, the morale. We're still like a mostly frowny face. Something like this. Ah, we already seen that. Whoa, it's Fern. It's nice to see a familiar face. She's staring at a map of expression of total confusion. Nurturing friend of a dog. Uh, let's recruit her. I, I wouldn't mind having somebody healthy on the team. So she has a good attitude and not terrible medical. Well, actually, that is pretty bad medical. That's one above the worst, I'm pretty sure. Fern is a natural enemy of the zombie. That is completely true. Car abandoned because we're out of gas. Oh, no. Walking Fern doesn't notice a hole in her backpack. Oh, great. Her morale's gone down. We lost some food, so ammo, and some rifle ammo, and shotgun ammo. Good job, Fern! Groups attempt to camping is interrupted by a very angry bear. They are forced to abandon the camp with a little sleep and must be paying a decision about what to grab. We'll grab the food. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. At least our morale's back up from the food. Those are soon starting the wounds, tries to help, but like, yeah. Uh, there's nothing life threatening about it, it's just a long and miserable walk. They get bruised and battered and in multiple small accidents. Okay. So we're both tired. The city had rotten with zombies, the group knows walking through. Oh my god, they're hunting in very thick. Good luck, everybody, that's not me. Yeah, just keep coming. I, I wish you could tell them not to fight so much. That should definitely be an option. It's like, avoid fighting at all costs and get the fudge out of here. I know we aren't going to get very much gas, but we just need to get on. Get on! Get in the car, you dummy! Cheese it! I know we missed out on all that stuff, but that was not a good situation. Finds it still shine. Oh my god! Got some gas and some. Let's. Try to play the car and have a little further before breaking down. They're pressed safe. Good part of the day and are very difficult. The car runs like new and the car looks undamaged. What? Eat a distant mill. The morale goes up. Mechanical scale increases. Oh my god, but it takes 16 gas to pop. Moderate and hunting. Uh. Sorry. I want to find a Yalmart or something. I wonder if you can barely see the shape of a cabin. Uh, we'll investigate the cabin. That doesn't seem like the worst thing in the world to do. It is dark though, so. We do need to be careful. Oh, I gotta set up in my seat. I can't see crap. We're zombies for that fact. Now, how big could this cabin actually be is the question. That. I mean, I mostly want to, like, not use it that much, right? I do want to try it, though. Oh, it's just a melee weapon. I thought, like, 100% it would be, like, vroom, kill everything. Is that a non-rusty machete? Uh, it didn't say, because it's still rusty. Yo, girl, be careful, dog. They want to eat your booty! I did not mean to shoot, and I am sorry I did it. Oh, it is working this time. Oh, it does take gas. Interesting. Was there anything actually in here? No, we just wasted our time. Okay, well, we got a little bit of gas. I'm getting tired, so. Oh, I didn't mean to shut the door on my bay. My bay girl, though. Um, let's get the hell out of here. The chainsaw was interesting, at least. I'm gonna take a quick look around. I don't think there's anything else. Like, I would be very, very surprised if we found some just out in the wild. But, you know, like, maybe there's berry bushes, this berry. Ah, it's a zombie! Wh what? Pretty sneaky, bro. Let's get the hell out of here. That wasn't so bad. We wasted a lot of gas getting here, though, unfortunately. Oh, we got some food. We got a little. We actually went up in gas, so I'm not gonna complain. We got a chainsaw. I've never seen a chainsaw in this game. 
Group finds a large campsite occupied by a few carloads of other survivors. Camping with strangers is risky, but there's nowhere else to go. None are heading to Canada? That scares me. We're going to bring themselves to trust on any of these strangers. They decide it's safer to drive away as soon as they can. They're not heading to Canada, man. Everybody knows Canada is where you need to be. You start running the city as long as you become more aggressive in response for reasons that have not been explained. Moderate and they're irritated. Apartment with bark banner. Dude. Okay. I normally wouldn't do this. So we're gonna be leading with Fern. What do you have? Okay. I think I want this on you. Actually, you're just such a better shot though. Damn it, I did it anyway. Jeremiah's actually a pretty good shot if I'm not mistaken, so we'll we'll keep it like it was, I guess, and just use the melee weapon. So it said it said something about a dog on it, and if I remember correctly, I hope I'm correct about this. I thought I remembered saying that she was friends of dogs in her description. So if she's friends of dogs, and if we find a dog, maybe can we can recruit a dog? I don't know how that works exactly, but Man, these nail boards are really slow, but they're really strong. I wanna kill this guy because Oh, what? Was that sad? Oh, that's probably me already being tired. Makes sense. Damn furniture! Never let the zombies do anything. What's this? Junk. Oh, I was so, so hoping for medical supplies. Not gonna lie, we are a bit in need of the medical supplies right now. Yo, yeah, as we'll say, you you can attack too, dog. You're strong. Yo, there's so many people coming out of here. Man, this, this chick is strong as a mofo. Ooh, free stuff. Ooh, free stuff. There's a, there's a cane. It's a pimp cane! And... Excuse me. <laughs> uh, I'll shut that door for you. I'll, I'm on my way out. I'm a gentleman. A gentlewoman. You know, always keep burgers in your nightstand? Hell yeah. Who doesn't do that, honestly? I mean, there's a burger right beside my, my workstation over here. Yeah. It doesn't look like- it kind of looks like a gun case, but there's nothing in it. So I might just be wishing it was a gun case. Look like anything's in here. Those things are like jiggling a little bit though, man. Nothing was in here. Yo. Where's my buddy at? Dog? Did you get confused by furniture again? What did the furniture do to you this time? Yeah, come on out. No, quit slapping. I, I know you're big and strong. Quit slapping. Hmm, room over here. Screw you. <laughs> I should've shut the door on him. That's something I need to start doing, is shutting doors on zombies, man. Oops. It's kinda hard to get the hang of, though, to be honest. Is that a spatula? A spatula! What's this? Another meat cleaver? Yeah. It's kind of gross how you walk over their organs and stuff. Just plop, plop, plop. And I mean, it is a zombie apocalypse, I suppose. So. This is medical supplies. <gasps> yes. You had me at hello. We're gonna save Jeremiah. Burger? Junk. Damn. Much less interesting than a burger. That's what we all wanted to see. She gets stuck at, or he gets stuck in furniture again. Wait, have we not been in here? There's a, uh, you phony, you big fat phony. Okay, we definitely need another wooded board. Come on through, come on through. Let's go in. Damn, son. Shooting up a storm here. Come on, come on. We gotta, we gotta kite. We gotta kite. 
Do you know what kiting is? That's where you run around in circles so things don't hit you. I wonder how they choose when to use bullets and when not to use bullets. I'd be very curious to have that information. Holy crap, these zombies. Okay, let's go this way. Mmm, nothing. This kind of looks like a... That's something, yeah. Eh, yeah, come on through. Oh, that's a lot of zombies. Hey! Dog seems unusually tame. Most dogs that are still alive have become feral at this point. This dog seems eager to see humans. Hell yeah, let the dog follow us. Cassandra starts following Fern. She could be useful if you can get her out of here alive. Dude, it's a dog named Cassandra. Of course it's going to be useful. What a beautiful name. Cassandra? Hell yeah. It's my dog's name right there. It's, it's my new dog's name, you know. We're... And... As for usual, nothing in the bathroom. Always a disappointment when you go to the bathroom, man. I mean, not in real life, hopefully. Alright, we gotta fight here for a second. You, you broke the bed! Dude, that machete is kicking ass. The rusty machete. Five shotgun shells. Eh, empty bathroom. This dog is adorable. Gonna, I'm gonna feel real bad when I have to do something stupid and the poor dog dies! No! Hey, why you open that? Quit. Oh, more medical supplies. I think there was one more place we need to go to. I think it was to the left, if I'm not mistaken. Dog fucking bit his ass. That's a lot of zombies. Oh, okay. Let's go this way. You can fight them a little bit right here. Oh god. Ah, get up here. Go in here. It's, it's not looking good, boys. Maybe if we can take him one at a time. I don't care, if you gotta use that chainsaw, you use it, baby. Oh, they're like slipping on the guts. I, I don't like the situation we're in, but I think I like this situation more than just standing out there with all the zombies. So if they slip on the guts, they die in like one hit. Alright, let's wait for us to recover some... We're tired, we're tired. We're tired in a bad situation, and we're... Okay, you know what? Come on, boys. Come on, boys and dog. Now, what's in here? Is it a shotgun? Some kind of gun? Okay, it is a shotgun. I don't want to. I don't want to use it though. Not yet. Okay, nothing was in there. We closed that door. We got one gasoline from that or something stupid. I see a fridge, or not a fridge. I see a stove up here. Which looks seven gasoline. Oh, cause it's a gas stove. Kerpa frickin' derpa. So genius. Hey, don't don't you bang on that door, boy. Doesn't look like we can go over there. We've been in both these buildings, I'm 99% sure. Hey, that was a damn nice adventure. Is he, is he in the thing? Okay, he's in. It it didn't do like the little movement animation. So we went from 3 to 61 gas, that's incredible. I don't- where did we get the gas? Oh, is it because we took all of it for the chainsaw? Of course we are recruiting a dog. Onward to Canada! With the puppy. Who seems really happy. Never leave home without a trusty can opener. Yes, we're healed. The group has asked for help by a settlement. They say they will be read by bandits soon if the group helps. With the defense, they were awarded 15 foot amount on a cowboy rifle. This could be very dangerous. Um. Mm, I'm sorry. We're on the road to Canada. Bye. I feel bad. Feels bad, man. We're about to be out of gas again. 
edible berry bushes on the campsite. The berries wouldn't be a big amount of food, but okay. you know what? Let's just let's get some good sleep for once. We never get good sleep anymore. Plus, we can use some morale, man. We're very thick. They're calm, though. Yeah, we're gonna search this tunnel, 100%. The thing about calm zombies is, yeah, the thing about calm zombies is, is most of the time you can kind of get away with searching through them and uh, grabbing everything that you want. Uh, I want that gasoline, dog. All right, we're gonna go up and around. So the nice thing also it would seem is that this is a walled off area so like we can't get zombies coming in from like magical areas on the side that we can't see now do we have to push our way through this how will we get through this Ugh. ah let me throw they angry I think we can get through now. We just gotta kill these damn zombies in the way. I, I don't wanna use a lot of ammo, but getting through doesn't seem like a terrible idea. Hey, let's just go around. Come. Oh, you guys! Oh, what? They got through? Come on. Come on through. We need to kill these zombies because they're in the way, and then we're gonna loot that crap, and then we're gonna be onwards to Canada. I will go to Canada. Oh my God, it's it's all coming up, boys. It's all good. So do we just leave here? Like, is this how we just leave? Yes, let's sit there. Okay, so we got a lot of gasoline. We got some medical. That was great. Those calm zombies were very nice. Every day gets a little closer to Canada. Damn straight. Another person is still in a park bench. He seems friendly. They have a conversation just like before the world ended. What was the main topic? Uh, when a dog is going to give advice, you got to let it happen. Barks in a very wise and experienced way. The friendly survivor is enlightened by the advice and gives some great tips of his own. So, what? We got mechanical and medical. Oh my god, our mechanical? Oh, we're f our dog is a genius at vehicles. What the hell? Friends lighting around but for dogs. The dog approaches the journey. I'm sorry. Uh... Do we want the 4-0, baby? Can the dog have equipment? Wait, you can wield something? You're kidding, right? Does this work? What? Okay. Um, I'm sorry, Henry. We don't have the food to take on another person right now. We're eating like six a night or something. Dude camps out in a pro shop near a golf course. Friend looks out the window and sees a large group of zombies approaching from the driving range. Golf balls to the zombies right away. Sleep, prepare for siege. Shoot golf balls at them. Get some golf balls to start driving. It's hard work, but the team mostly just tires themselves out. They are overwhelmed by zombies. Great. So we're all hurt to fuck now. Good job. So our dog is extremely dumb, but also extremely intelligent at uh, mechanical things. And street town has traps all over it. That's with blankets put over the top, snares everywhere, spikes and roll, a door with an obvious guillotine over it. These are just invisible and send a scout to explore for loot. Hell no. Somebody look how look at our HP. We would be boned. Right, what a nice day for a road trip. Group of two is making progress on the death road as one person eh, okay. Maybe if we can buy some medical supplies or something, I would be happy. Okay, new swords. Clank around as he moves. Cheap katana. Sturdy machete. Ah, eh, we don't have very much food. Oh, maybe there's free loot. There's a dog selling something over there. Hey. 
Hey, get out of my house. Fuck you, I'm taking your food. Dumbass. <laughs> Why am I so mean all of a sudden? I'm sorry. Hi, puppy. Are you a dog? Finds a dog surrounded by a bunch of ammo. The dog speaks. Welcome to the Ammo Emporium. Everything must go. It offers five bulls for... For... For new dog psychology? In order to get a huge free ammo from the dog, it's great and this works. What? 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 This dog is carrying a machete now! Boost goes on slowly and probably down. An easy medical call, I think. Um. We don't have the food, but I would have loved to have done that. Was there nothing else down here? This guy is scaring me with that katana, dude. Getting the hell out of here. I can't believe. Wait, really? Hello? There we go. I'll just say, just give, give and go, give and go. Well, we're about to abandon this vehicle. Feels bad, man. It's hell, relax. Yeah, yeah. We're on foot again, boys and dog. Here's Rob Bug Bandits. The bandits are of a kind that would normally not be a problem if the group had a car or wasn't tired from walking all day. We have to refuse to fight. We only have 12 food. Did anybody die? Nobody died. That's all that really matters. Sandra inspected this. We saw an ember, so she set her plants up shortly before the bandits appeared. Of course she did. When the bandits make their demands on Cassandra, the other members sneak behind them in a counter ambush. They're surprised by this and surrender. So we get morale. Cassandra's terrible attitude, but our morale has increased. Hey, good job, Cassandra. He was walking through the countryside, so it was on a burnt out cars with zombies, very thick, irritated, and late at night. Oh, yay. Does this mean we have full golf? Four golf clubs? It is exactly what I meant. Oh, we got it from where we were idiots. I need this. Oh, I gotta sip in my chair. Gotta sip in my chair and move at the same time. Excuse me. Oh, come on. Come on. Wait, use your logic, boys. We gotta get the hell out of here. I just wanna survive. I just wanna survive and now I see... I see loot. Fuck it. Get out. Get out. Ah. Uh, grab. Okay, go down. Go down. Get shotgun. Nope. Nope. We're dead. Get in the vehicle. No. Wait, did we all die? Oh, Cassandra's all on. Cassandra, go! <laughs> Your mechanical skills are second to none! <laughs> no one wants to drive the car, the journey to Canada is in it. Oh wait, there's still a dog life. Cassandra thinks one word and her primitive out of mind. Canada. Cassandra gets the keys and put- Okay. Yep. Hell yeah. Not a mm. doubt in my mind. Oh yeah, we didn't get any- Cause everybody died! Because one of the guys is very uneventful, but at least there's no zombies in dangerous sight for the first time in a long time. You're able to walk or drop the garden. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure. Our HP is like one. The fortune to find an abandoned cabin in the woods to stay night nice. shortly after setting up a storm moves in. Luckily for her, she found the cabin in time. It's a decent mill. Rolls up her sleeves and starts saying to her wounds, You're very terrible at medical. Good to know. I mean, not real. Okay, whatever. 81 gas. We got a vehicle somehow. Overwhelming, try to survive late morning. Oh, this is just my life right here. It's just my life. Oh, wait, it's 30 minutes in the video. Holy crap, how time flies. Well, that's gonna do it for uh, today's video on Death Road to Canada. We got a dog, uh, we got a dog, 81 fuel, and a dream. And that's what we're living off right now. So, if you guys like to hit the like button, it lets me know you're enjoying the series and all the good stuff. If you guys are, please leave a comment down in the comment section below. I read and respond to every single one. Subscribe if you have you blah 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 blah. Yeah, subscribe if you haven't already. Recommend to anyone who may be interested. And I hope you guys have the most amazing day in the whole damn world. See you guys on the death road to Canada.